You know, people have been criticized and jabbed at and talked about throughout the ages for having different beliefs. And apparently I am no exception. Although it is a constant challenge, I will continue. I will not allow them to stop me. I will teach as a shaman and help those who seek the knowledge. It's just that simple. I know what I do, and it's what I believe in. There's a birthmark somewhere on his face, correct? Yeah. Yeah, that's the daddy. Oh, yes. She was stealing, you know that, right? Oh, my God. Found that out a couple months ago. Yeah, man. And you will be back in court in the next 21 days, won't you? Exactly. Yeah. You were feeling as if she was cheating on you, weren't you? Yeah, I did. That's what she was. And this is around a relationship. Talk about it. Uh, okay? Don't make me take you to church, young man. <laughs> The light of truth will not be denied. Call now. Call 1-800. Hello, darlings. This is Miss Cleo coming to you live from our studio. And it is very special and commercial. I'll be taking calls and giving psychic readings live on the air. Oh, my goodness. Would you look at that? I can tell you things about the future that you'd never learn on your own. Really? So call me now. I'm going to do that. <laughs> Operators are standing by. Oh, and we have our very first caller. Hello, caller. Hello. Is, is this Cleo? Yes, baby, it is. Oh, aren't you the one that can see into the future? Yes, darling. You got the right Cleo. Oh, honey, can, can I ask you a question? One. Was you working on September the 10th? <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Really? Uh, you didn't see anything strange gonna happen on that next day? Um, uh, no. Nothing? Uh. Not a single, nothing you could go on TV and, and maybe warn people about? What, a, oh, what, was you working September of the 9th? And maybe you got a message from the spirits saying something like, Hey, Cleo, get your American flags while they still cheap. <laughs> Do you remember them saying anything like that? No, darling, no, no. Well, that's a big thing for them to miss, isn't it? <laughs> well, honey, Jeff, what about on September the 8th? Did you, do you remember getting any psychic messages like three more days till Gary Condon ain't in the headline? Uh, caller, dear, listen to me, Caller. Okay, um, now the psychic world and the spiritual world can be very, very tricky, okay? Oh. And, and I didn't think t to ask about that kind of information, you see. I, that'd be the first thing I'd ask every day, you know, just in case. I'd say, spirits, any tra historical tragedies coming up soon? I did feel something, okay? Because I got a lot of bad, bad vibes on that day. So do you know who you remind me of? My friend Zelda. She does that same thing. We like to watch Jeopardy together. You ever seen that show? Yes. It's with Alex Trebek. He sure looks like he smells good, doesn't he? But anyway, Zelda come over and we watch that program. And she says the answers at the same time Alex says them. So you can't even tell if she's smart or she's just being real tricky. <laughs> That's who you remind me of, honey. Yo, okay, well, let me tell you something, okay? I'm not tricky, okay? Ooh. I am a certified psychic, so oh. if you have any personal questions pertaining to your personal life, please ask me now, okay? Oh, uh, yeah, I sure do, honey. Okay. Uh, my husband, he's been so irritable lately. Yes, I see that in the cards. In fact, I know you've been married for a very long time. Yes, we have. We've been married for 65, 65 years. That's what I'm talking about right there. <laughs> Honey, I love my husband. I know, I see I that. I sure do, I love him. And I was wondering if you could tell me where I could find Osama Bin Laden. Cleo. <laughs> oh, we got disconnected. <laughs> Soon I didn't get a chance to finish asking. 
asking my questions. Oh, child. Oh, my goodness. Please, please, please. 